Sorry, my friends. I've got it all covered up and I've done the connections as you guys suggested. Thank you very much. So I've got my pressure, a uh, positive here and the negative. And uh, the meters now should work. I've cleaned the plug and I've cleaned the points of the lister. So let's uh, give it a start up quickly and see what happened. I'll put you so that you can see the meters and remember it will it might run a while for before this is uh, start working and I've got the other meter there or the motor that we also can test if the lister runs nice okay let's go hope for a good start up it is the first one I didn't start it this morning the amp meter. Let me try and get it going again. Okay. There it is guys. Thank you so much. As I mentioned, 6 volt motor. It's about 5 and about 4 amps. I just want to see I've got a fuel problem on the formal. Ach, oh, a little lister. Let me try and sort it up quickly. Okay, here we go again. That's how beautiful it is. Thank you very much. If you die, I will connect it to the other motor and see what amps will get to. Let me do that quickly. Okay, let me see. I think the vaults jump around because of the waves that is not consistent. something went wrong with my audio uh, I don't know why really don't know why but what happened is it works now you've seen that and uh, my fan belt broke and I made myself that broke off at the end and what I also discussed uh, what had not come out is I found the, the problem on the lister let me show you that you won't believe what it is I showed it in the video, but uh, my voice doesn't come through. This uh, this is the shutdown, and then you open it about a quarter turn, and it run. What happens when it idles or, or run? It vibrates itself to the close position, and the engine die. That is what happened all the time for weeks now. It's just simple. It turned itself close and I discovered that by when I start it again I feel but it is in a closed position why and then I hold it with my hand and it keep on running and I put a piece of stick there branch just to keep it uh, stationary and the machine keep running no problem so this was all the problem 
on, on, the, on the lister. It got here a spring with a little ball that's supposed to keep it stationary. I think that ball get lost. So I'll put a new one in. The, the spring is still there. But everything works guys. Thanks very much. There is my two thick wires. This is the two thick wires coming out. This is a negative. And this is the positive. I just put this handle here to keep it apart. This is the wires of the 6 volt motor. And um, you've seen you've seen the meters work. So I just need a fan belt now. One thing after another. Okay guys, um, this is now a success. And I think I di didn't come out as well. My next project is to put this back. I need a little bit of repair on the governor. This is the governor part. Just to control the revs so that it is, it is consistent. So this is on the next project to repair that. Okay guys, thanks for watching and uh, thanks for all your help. I've covered it up. Everything is connected as you as you said. Okay guys, see you on the next one. Bye.